what is up guys it's Sobash. welcome back we are gonna play some more mobile legends today and guess what the game is finally released uh checked out in the google play store it is out now in the united states you can download it it is called mobile legends bang bang all right and just off the top of the head it's uh it's a little crazy uh looking in the google play store it's already at over 5 million downloads worldwide so this is going to be a pretty big community and really big game so if you want to try it out guys it is not available yet on ios but i will let you know when it is all right so let's get into the gameplay we're going to do some rank today and i'm going to use a, another legend that i have just acquired and she is basically another range hero but she does a lot faster damage than the other one has and has a little bit different ultimate as well all right so maya is the character we're going to take a look at she is a marksman and the reap and let's take a look at her abilities she has a turbo passive each time she has a basic attack hits a target the hero's attack speed will increase by four percent lasting three seconds and stacks up to 10 times that's pretty big boost uh, we also have Fission Shot. After you use each basic attack, will fire two split arrows, dealing 10 points of magic damage to the main target and 70% basic attack damage to the other target. That lasts for four seconds. We also have Rain of Arrows. Shoots a barrage of arrows towards an area, dealing five hits of damage to enemies. Each hits 50 points of physical damage. The arrow storm will slow the enemies down after four hits, and the enemy will be frozen in its place for one second. And the ultimate, which is Turbo Stealth, used to reduce oh we didn't get that one but i'll show you to you in just a second all right so for that last one the ultimate was turbo still used to remove all movement impairing effects from yourself become invisible for one second also increases your speed by 35 percent and movement of nearby teammates for 45 percent so uh, not only does it help you it helps your teammates out all right, so we are going to drop down. Let's find the person that we actually went in with, which is, I'm not sure what he's playing, the tank. So I'm in the middle lane right now. And we had another come from bottom up to mid. So I'm gonna transition up to mid and I believe he is on a tank right now. So let's go up here. It's another Maya up here. And he is on the tank right there. And uh, that guy's got a pretty good dash in. He's really good at initiating fights. Uh, with this one, I'm pretty much going to stay range. I'm not going to be able to take very many good hits. Uh, I have redone just one piece of the gear that I'm normally using. Instead of recommended builds, I'm actually using one that if I die, it brings me back to life with 15% life and a shield that covers 40% of my life. So I've got that extra chance of actually living. Now that is only going to be able to go off every 180 seconds. So that's something I'm going to have to wait for if I do use it. But they're pushing back pretty hard right there. So I'm going to drop back down that bottom tower down there. Nobody's contesting against it. There looks like they're shifting. So I'm going to stay at mid to pick up on some of these minions while he's transferring the help. And that ability right there has two arrows that come out, multiples if more are in your range, but it has to be in your general direction. So you can't actually just use it and shoot in a 360 degree radius around you. It's only gonna be like frontal, comb, and that guy's using a healing ability, which is quite annoying. See if we can't get him stuck in the frost. We did, but we weren't able to capitalize because I was trying to avoid that ability he used. And we're gonna pop out from the side. Let's see if we can't take him down. He got pulled back by him. He's gonna end up getting killed. Yes, he does. So I'm gonna move on. Actually, uh, let's get a push on this tower. I'm gonna utilize my ultimate. It makes me shoot a lot faster and do more damage. So we're gonna take this tower out maya is very very good at doing this as you can run also another buff i'm currently using uh, redemption or uh, retribution and what that does is basically it attacks uh, npc and does quite a bit of damage to him so it's it helps me farm up can farm a lot quicker 
while kind of roaming and uh, helping out different lanes. And we're gonna try to save this lane right here. And let's see, he went back up. No, he's trying to swoop around. They try to do that to get that extra little shots and damage onto you, but I'm gonna use my regen, stay under the tower for protection. Uh, for these towers, they do they do offer you a lot more protection from some of the other MOBAs I have played. Now here comes my piece of armor that I'm actually wanting. You see the white around me now? That lets me know that my shield is up and available. And if I do die, I will come back to life. Now we got four people down here merging on the bottom tower. The fifth is coming, so this tower is probably fixing to go down. Got a kill there. And we just need some minions now. That way we can push on the tower. It's a uh, one strategy people use, you know, just bully up on one tower just to take it out. Because uh, if they don't all come and pay attention, uh, you can easily take it down with just one or two people protecting it. And what I'm doing currently is just keeping them back out from under the tower as much as I can. And they're finally going to take that last minion out. The team's dispersed back to their own towers now. So we're just going to continue farming up, pushing on the lane. Now these games can last, I've had some last over 20 minutes recently. I have been playing a lot. These are ranked matches by the way. So you're looking at currently the top 4,000 under right here. And one of the guys that's with me, he is actually ranked within the top 20. I don't have the right spell. So I'm gonna get lucky if I do get away here. All right, the minions did take that hit. Uh, regen was actually changed. The last video I did, regen, you could use it and it just continued ticking regardless. Now, if you use regen and you get hit, it stops regening. Um, that's basically the use for it, I guess they were wanting, was in between fights, you know, you can regen, but while you're fighting, you don't need a constant heal over time that just doesn't go away. So that's what happens now is if you do get hit while you're regening, that does go away. Now, I thought I'd drop that in there. You can control where you put your stuff. So pay attention to that. And if they leave this open, I'm gonna easily take this tower by myself. And we're gonna try for it. I'm not really sure why that targeted me like that. Now here comes the uh, resurrection but it shouldn't have actually targeted me like that because I didn't really hit any other person there. All right, I'm gonna have to hide in the bush and recall. And generally you only get targeted uh, if you're in range and no other minion is, or if you go under a tower and hit another player. Now, the reason it probably targeted me there was I ran in a little bit before the minions actually got under there after that first one died. So that's probably why I was targeted there. Mistake on my part, but mistakes do happen. Just got to learn from them. Now, there's three people pushing towards this middle tower here. And it just got destroyed. All right, so this is our buddy right here. We're going to go on this lane and push. I do have my life still now. Level 9. Max level was 15, as you remember. And let's go ahead and take out all these guys. And we'll go ahead and push up top further. Had another guy come in and we got three converging on us in the middle. I'm stuck. I'm going to have to get out, heal up. No, he didn't. Okay, he did. He almost killed me there. Definitely going to have to go back. All right, so coming back, you realize somebody is up top corner. So I'm going to try to distract him from this side as he gets countered from the back side. And hopefully we can get him and looks like he's probably going to get away there that's one of the harder ones to actually run down go ahead and kill some of these minions okay they did get him nice so i'm going to drive it down make sure none of these minions okay none of them survived and they're all the way up to the last tower so if everybody pays attention to that middle tower currently they're going to let me sneak in. I'm going to back door and we possibly could end this game pretty quick if they're not paying attention to the map. Uh, map this big, you really have to have a lot of map awareness. Know where your players are at, know where the other enemy players are at. 
As you can see, they show up on the map quite often. It's not like some when you're they're only close to you. You can pretty much see them just about all the time. Now, we have still nobody that's noticed I'm up here. I do have my ultimate up, so if I do get under this tower, which I am right now, it's fixing to be going down pretty quick. That increases my speed quite a bit. I'm able to shoot other things as well. And we're going to drop this tower, no problem. And oh, I got stunned, so we do need to back out. Hopefully I'm able to get away. I do have this one, uh, she's like a magic chick. That's about all she can really do is magic. I've got 12 seconds before my heal is back. It looks like we are gonna get away. She backed off, but I'm not gonna waste that heal. We're gonna hit bush and go back. All right, so only one person noticed me sneaking in there. So let's try that again on the bottom. Now this game, it doesn't really matter how many people you kill. Yeah, you're gonna get to max level. You'll get a little bit of gold for it but you can kill as many people as you want if you don't protect your base you're gonna lose uh that's what i do like about this game you can get killed as many times as you want to and still have that chance of winning just by people not paying attention and looks like we're gonna do that again here get that crit chance up and that tower is gone Maya is really good at taking out towers, and they still haven't really paid attention to me down here. So if they let me go again, we're going to take this next tower. And by the way, this, like I said, this is a rank match. So you, you would think people would be paying a lot more attention to their uh, places on the map. Yep, yep, here we go. Took that one down. And now they are wide open. Uh, they got one base left right there in the middle. And we're going to try to run in and end this as quick as we can. Uh, I'm going to use this here. A way I can attack everybody. And I do need to back out as I'm a little bit way too far under. Hit that regen. And they're attacking from the top side as well. So I'm going to come back in. All right, minions just came out. We have more minions coming ourselves right now. This Maya finally noticed me here. Okay, we got two, actually just one of them. Slow him down just a little bit. That's what that skill is pretty good for. He just uses ultimate. I'm gonna use mine and it's gonna be a fight to see who can do the most damage. It's probably gonna be him. I've never been able to really out DPS only. Whoa, guess we are, nice. We got some assistance right there at the end. Come in and help us. And our regen is down, so we're going to have to be very, very cautious. Turtle gives quite a bit of gold. That's about all it offers. So let's go to this middle lane and push on this last tower that they have up. It's like that's a, pretty much where everybody's starting to congregate at. Starting to protect this last lane. And I'm going to heal up. And it looks like we're going for the buff or the boss. And let's go ahead and take this guy out. Walked in just in time to get stunned by him. And he is down now. So I'm going to recall. That way I can heal all the way up and make use of this guy. Because there are no towers left for him to really go for unless he goes for mid. Now he should start right around here. And he's going to go bottom lane where there are no minions or no towers at all. I'm going to walk just in front of him. Actually, we're going to stop off right here and pick up this guy. And here's that retribution spell. I haven't really been using a lot because I've been trying to stick with lanes. But it's very useful in killing uh, stuff like that because I just got a buff from that guy. There's one on the opposite side of the map for the other team. And uh, they do different things. This one uh, increases movement speed by 15%. Uh, they just do different things. Uh, there's a couple different ones which are kind of useful throughout the fight to have and here we go we're gonna get people starting to get caught up and Maya's pretty strong she's got the ability to hit multiple people we just took him out is he gonna resurrect from a uh, thing no he's not so drop a frost and let's just go in and finish this match off uh, this is gonna be GG for them probably I'm not even really getting hit and their tower is taking so much it's over all right guys that's maya uh, there's a lot of things i probably could have done with her that i didn't 
but there's so many different ways to go with this game as far as strategies and whatnot. I'm currently only playing with another, one other person, so you can go in with yourself and solo, you can go in with two people, or you can go in with five. You can't go in with three or four people in a pre preset group. So with that in mind, you've got to just pick and choose who you're gonna go into rank with unless you go in with a solid five. Uh, if you have any questions about that, they'll cool, we got a win streak. Uh, if you have any questions about the game or anything, feel free to leave them in the comments below. As I said, we will answer anything we can. Uh, like I said, the game is out on Android currently, so if you want it, you can download it, and I will update you guys when it is available on iOS. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. I am Soulbash. You guys have a nice day. You're ready.